going to just use any kind of marinara that you, your favorite one that you get at the grocery store. Okay, great. Okay? Hi, I'm Catherine Lee, parenting expert, and this is Danielle, a fabulous <laughs> chef. She's going to show us today how to make a turkey pasta bolognese. Yes, yes, absolutely. Right. So we have basically garlic, we have two different kinds of squash, we have onions, we have carrots, and we have celery. Wow. These are actually microplaned with this instrument, uh -huh. and they actually, when you cook them, they reduce right into the sauce. The so kids don't even know. Oh. My kids would never eat Is squash on their own. Is that why you own. use a microplaner instead of... Then dicing it. Dicing it, okay. Oh, you could dice okay. it, but I just happen to do this this way. And it hides the vegetables better so the it kids does. don't know. Yes, okay. there you go. Perfect. So we're going to start with a little bit of olive oil. I would say about two tablespoons. Okay. And can you hand me the garlic and the onions, Catherine? Sure, absolutely. There's some garlic. We're just going to soften those. And so it's about four cloves of garlic and an entire onion. Now that these are soft and getting a little bit golden, we're going to grab the turkey and start cooking that off. Okay. Okay, so Catherine, this is getting close, and it is done. It's, you just want to make sure the, cook, the turkey is totally cooked through. So how many minutes does that take? About, About four or five minutes. Perfect. Okay, so could you hand me the carrots and the celery, because those guys are next. You got it. And we're just going to plop those in there. And look at the colors of this. It's beautiful. How many squashes did you use? Just one just small one yellow squash. and one small zucchini. So a yellow squash and a green squash, zucchini. And I'm going to get that in there as well. All right, now I want to go ahead and start the water for the pasta, because this is not going to be that much longer, but we need to get that going so it's all going to coincide with each other. Now, could you go ahead and give me the red wine? Okay. And I'm just going to eyeball this. It's about a cup. You can go to your own desired amounts, but I think the red wine tastes amazing in this, and it is a traditional thing that you put in. I didn't and again, I usually, this is traditionally used with um, beef stock, but mm -hmm. since we're doing turkey, the chicken stock will do about fine. Perfect. And that's about a cup as well. Okay. And the wine's going to cook off, right, if you're giving yes, this to kids? Yes, yes. Okay. And this is one can of diced tomatoes? Yep. Oh, that there. Oh, I can do that for you. You can cook. <laughs> well, this is the beauty of this, and this is what doesn't take us five hours, is that we're going to just use any kind of marinara that you, your favorite one that you get at the grocery store. Okay, great. Okay. All right, okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> she's, she's my hero. <laughs> and that, Whoa. I know, I went in there fast and furious. Awesome. I'm going to put time, and I'm just going to go ahead and put it, the whole things, the sprigs on, and we'll just pick the sticks out later. Okay. And okay, that was about five, six sprigs. Yes, yes. Okay. And then to season it with salt, about a tablespoon, mm -hmm. and pepper. And then you want to make sure you get a half, about a half a cup of sugar. Ooh, sugar. Oh. That's why the kids That's like it. Right. <laughs> and I just use a whole milk uh -huh. and about a cup. And it lightens up the sauce. Oh, look at that. And then I add about a half a cup of pecorino and to save the rest for garnish mm -hmm. and get that going and just give it a few more minutes and we'll be ready to we'll be ready to serve this one up so this is the pasta you're using what generally is the best type to use um, I use this fresh pasta because if you're on the go and yeah. you don't have time right. this only takes 60 seconds oh that's perfect this Good is parents wow <laughs> okay it's this angel hair uh -huh. you dump it in you blink your eyes a few times you strain it yeah. Oh, <laughs> yes. Awesome. And look, the sauce is done. Great. Come on, Sam. So here's Danielle's fabulous turkey bolognese sauce. What do you think about it? Do you think you'd eat that? I think that really looks, really looks good. Doesn't it? <laughs> I can't yeah. wait to eat I love it. him All already. Right. I just met you, Sam, but you're fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> this is a lighter version of a traditional bolognese. Yum. And it's quick. And it's tasty. Mm -hmm. And it's healthy. And I did not lie. It was quick. <laughs> it was did very I say quick? quick? <laughs> it was very quick, and it's very kid friendly, most important. Yes, important. there awesome. you go. Enjoy. Thank you so much, Danielle, You're for welcome. showing us how to make this pasta bolognese with turkey. How's it taste?
No. One time I caught Julian chewing his own toenails. It was really bad. 